he's so amazing to me sometimes. I was just thinking about him and his children and how he takes care of his truth. And I want the Lord to bless you, son. I thank God for all of our new converts. Amen. Not just saying that. Yes. I thank God yes. for our new company. Yes. If they've been here for 30, 40 years, yes. and they now see that they were lost, yes. no matter what they profess, yes. they are new converts. Yeah. Amen. And I'm grateful to God for, again, for each and every one. I praise God for all that he has done. So thank you for OJ and Ethel. Amen. Amen. I bless the Lord, yes. my soul, yes. bless the Lord. Yes. I'm so grateful to God that he is not like man. Yes. God is sometimes when I meditate on him, I be so amazed. How God looked down on wretched sinners like us. And when we get in a right position, he will save us. To the point that it will be as though you never sinned. And I'm so grateful. Yes. You don't boast in a wrong way about that. Right. But you fall down yes. even when you're standing up. Yes. You fall down in the spirit yes. before a holy God yes. and give him thanks yes. for what he has done. Yes. For sinners. Yes like us. Yes, Lord. I'm telling you, Sister Sarah, when you know it, yes. no one, yes. there will be no need for no one to yes. tell you yes. to praise God. Yes. Amen. Yes. Amen. Yes. Amen. Yes. But I honor the Lord tonight yes. for his all-seeing eye. Yes. Thankful all that he has done. We can put a period behind what God has done. Why? Because what he has done, it is done. Unchangeable. No man can change it. But we must come God's way. We cannot make our own way. That will not work. Joining the church will not get it. Getting baptized in water will not get it. Nothing man can do by himself will get it. But when it comes God's way, it is whatever he has said. We must see ourselves Lost and in need of a savior. Not get religious. That will not get it either. But lost and we see that we need a savior. We see that it's something that we need that we cannot do ourselves. 
God then will bless. Repentance is the way. Isn't that true, Sister Rob? Amen. Amen. Repentance that is wrought by God. I praise Him. We can say what we want to. It must be God's way. Thank God again for all of you. May God bless you all. Let's turn our Bibles to the book of Psalms. 91. And I truly praise God for our sister Lorraine. Amen. Amen. And our brother Tommy. Amen. Amen. Just hoping that I haven't missed no one. Which before I called their name, I had already thanked God for them. Amen. But sometimes if the right spirit is not working, some become offended. But that shows you got to grow. Move out of that place. Amen. Psalms 91, and we would like to read one verse here, verse 2. I will say of the Lord, he is my refuge and my fortress. My God, in him will I trust. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I truly thank God for the provision that he has made for his people. When sometimes it gets to the point that we cannot See our way. God has already made provision. But then we must learn to trust him. And not our thoughts. Our thoughts sometimes will cause us to be troubled all the time. But I'm so grateful to God what he has already done for us. And for a thought, God is our refuge. Let us begin reading now at verse 1. He that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. I tell you what, how wonderful that is. That heavenly protection. That heavenly protection. Protection that you cannot give yourself. Protection that no man can give you that heavenly protection. Who would not want to be protected? I'm talking about from whatever life has to offer. But protect it. Why? Because you are. If you are born again. His child. It is a promise. Thank you Jesus. See that's why. Our assurance lies in. How we live. There is no way no one can feel God's protection as you have sat around 
talking about people, being idle, loving yourself, loving your children, your husband, your wife, more than God. There's no way you can feel God's heavenly protection. Even though you might think you have it. But you cannot feel that you have the heavenly, heavenly protection of God. And you are in yourself. That's right. That's right. Therefore, we must denounce yes. ourselves. Yes. Become willing. To suffer for his name's sake. And in that, and we'll believe in that this is a psalm of David. Not sure some say Moses, but we, we are not going to go into that. Because that part is not so important. But it's what he says. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. He that dwelleth in the secret place of the most high. That secret place. Amen. That secret place that God knows about. And if you are walking with him, you have access to that secret place. Yes. Thank you. Amen. Yes. I'm telling you, the psalmist, David or whomever, own resolution to take God for his people. It's good to know that God is your keeper. It is good to know that my safe place, my safe place, is in Jesus, not in, thank you, Jesus. Just maybe because I might say amen, not in that. But how you live. I'm praising God for this son because I'm telling you, it is security in this song. Who in this world who has knowledge of God will not want to be secure in God. Who would not want to be? Whether we say it or not, I can say it. If we are not living the life that God requires of us, thank you, Jesus, then we should not look for that heavenly protection. We should not, we should never think this though, but many does. We should never think that God owes us. People, we are too wretched. To think that God owe us something. But listen to this. When a person see that they are lost and in need of a savior, come to him, repent of their sins, then he says that you are kings and you are queens. Look how he is. 
so different from us. Because we are still to be saying, well, they did this to me and they did that. No, no, no. No, no. God will bless us. Amen. When we come his way. He will bless us. And I'm glad about this. When we come to him with a pure heart. And these promises are to those who are sincere from the heart. Are you glad? Yes. He that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High shall abide. That means stay there. Under the shadow of the Almighty. Do you praise him? Thank you, Jesus. Let us go to Psalms 27. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. And verse 5, Psalms 27 and verse 5. For in the time of trouble, he shall hide me in his pavilion. Now, isn't that, isn't that something? Yes. In the time of trouble. Yes. That's right. No matter what trouble. That's right. But in the time of trouble. Thank you, Jesus. He shall hide me. No one can hide like God can. Yes. He can hide you out of the sight of your trouble. Yes. I thank God. For in the time of trouble, he shall hide me in what? In his pavilion. I have a place. I have a place. That I can hide you. To the point that. Trouble. Cannot find you. That mountain top experience. Mr. Ray. Hallelujah. Do you praise God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. In the time of trouble, he shall hide me in his pavilion. Mm -hmm. In the secret of his tabernacle shall he hide me. In the secret of his tabernacle shall he hide me. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Jesus. And what will he do? He shall set me upon a rock. He shall set me upon a rock. Yes. I will put you in a place. Yes, Lord. Yes. That's right. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. And it will be something solid. Thank you, Jesus. It will be something to depend on. Yes. yes. Thank you, Jesus. You praise God. Yes. Are you thankful? About Jesus. Yes. Now, if you have repented, then you are not walking in sin. Amen. Amen. See, we want certain things but we want 
certain things our way. It's not like that. It is not like that. I would like for the usher to turn on the fans, please. I'm working, you all just sit down. Thank you, Jesus. And these promises, we have a right, W-R-I-T. We have a right to this protection. Just because we've seen ourselves lost. And when we saw, was able to see that we were lost, conviction of God told us whosoever is, that is born again. We are a sinner. And I'm out here and I am unprotected. But you can only know that. Thank you, Jesus. We can only know that when God has convicted our very soul, our inner man. Do you praise him? Are you thankful? For in the time of trouble, and I'm telling you, it can be trouble. And sometimes trouble comes, and it comes from someone that you never thought it would come from. And trouble can come just like that. But God has said, I will hide you. Man be trying to tear you down to nothing. But God said, I'll hide you. Amen. And then after hiding me, he will put me up on something that is solid. Yes. Thankful. Amen. Amen. Psalm 31. Thank you, Jesus. We begin reading Psalms 31 and verse 19. Oh, how great is thy goodness. In God, goodness great. Thank you. When I'm able to see a wretched man, I am. Who shall deliver me from this body of sin? That's right. But I thank God through Jesus Christ. Yes. I am Damn. delivered. Yes. Yes. Amen. If I've given my life to him, I've been washed yes. in the blood of the Lamb. Yes. Clean. Yes. Has been clean yes. from all sin. Yes. Do you praise him? Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. 31 and Continue reading verse 19. Oh, how great is thy goodness, which thou hast laid up for them that fear thee. See, it's not, it's not for everyone. In. It's for those who fear the Lord. Amen. You're not going to act any kind of way. And you're not going around hurting people. And people to the bone. Yes. And you don't, you, you, in some way, darkness, you don't even know you've done that. Yes. I'm telling you, people. Yes. Thank you, Jesus, for them that fear thee, uh -huh. fear the Lord. Mm -hmm. 
which thou hast wrought for them that trust in thee before the sons of men. We need to trust him, don't we? Yes. We need to trust God. Yes. I need to trust the Lord. Amen. What do I need to trust him for? I need to trust him for everything. Yes. Amen. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. And it says before the sons of men. You know, sometimes we, we say things, but we do not live right before people. But we must live a clean and a holy life before people. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. This is our main verse here. Verse 20. Thou shalt hide them in the secret of thy presence from the pride of men. Now, isn't that something? Thank you, Jesus. Thou shalt hide them in the secret of thy presence. From the pride of men. Isn't that something? When men plot, or men plot against you. Because I see them. You might not even know. What's going on in their mind against you? But God said, I know. But I've already made provision for you. Amen. He says that what? Thou shalt keep them secretly. No, First, mm -hmm. thou shalt hide them mm -hmm. in the secret of thy presence. In the secret of thy presence. Yes. Yes. Where the presence of the Lord is. Yes. yes. Thank you. Anything. Yes. Meaning what God does yes. can happen. Yes. In his presence. Yes. Telling you, I said, Lord, be my helper. Yes. As the psalmist knew, I need someone greater than I am to be my keeper. Now, if we can keep it ourselves, amen. If we can keep ourselves well we don't need a keeper That's right. amen. amen but I'm so grateful to the Lord thou shall hide them in the secret of thy presence from the pride of men amen, amen. When men are plotting, scheming, and plotting against you, it can just be in their mind. God said, I have it all. You don't have to worry about a thing. I have it all. Amen. Read on. Thou shalt keep them secretly in a pavilion from the strife of tongues. Amen. When they saying all type of things 
to cut you down. Amen. Amen. I think Sister Sarah, I had a dream just like that spirit that be trying to torment you. That's an evil spirit. That is something so evil. It was so much like it, because I, I, I said to Makibo, I said, um, that spirit that be bothering Sarah, I said, I think I feel it. Yes. That's an evil spirit. Yes. And thanks be unto God. You have such a praise. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Yes. If you did not have the praise you have, yes. it could not ward yes. that spirit away. Yes. But I'm thankful yes. in God's presence. Yes. Amen. Yes. God said, I will keep you. Thou shalt hide, and I'm going to let you read it all, Sister Carol. Verse, verse 20. 20. Thou shalt hide them in the secret of thy presence. Thou shalt hide them in the secret of what? Thy presence. Thy presence. No why it's secret? Yes. Thank you. Because they don't know nothing about it. Yes. Oh, they don't know one thing about it. Yes. How does, how in the world she's able to take it? Yes, Amen. When I can't praise God like I praise him in here. Yes. I still have my praises yes. on the inside. Yes. That's how yes. I'm able to take it. Yes. Do you praise him? Do you praise him? Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Thou shalt keep them what? Thou shalt keep them secretly uh -huh. in a pavilion from the strife of tongues. That pavilion it is something like a shelter. Yes. I have a place for you. Yes. I have a shelter. Yes. And this shelter is not seen by man. Yes. But I'm covered. Yes. Do you praise it? Yes. Do you praise the Lord? Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Glory be to God. Amen. Psalm 32. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Start reading at verse 6. Yes, ma'am. For this shall everyone that is godly. Pray unto thee in a time when thou mayest be found. Uh -huh. Surely in the floods of great waters, they shall not come nigh unto thee. Oh, Lord. I tell you, you can be muddy waters. Amen. You cannot even see. Your sight is so short, you cannot even see. But I thank God. He sees for us. Yes. The waters might be so muddy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Verse 7. Verse 7 here is our main verse. Thou art my hiding place. Thou art my hiding place. Thank you, Jesus. 
Thank do we you. allow God to hide us? Yes, yes. Lord. Yes. Or do we try to take matters in That's our own right. hands? That's right. That's right. So true. Thank so you, true. Jesus. Praise him. Praise him. Thou art my hiding place. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thou shalt preserve me Thou from trouble. Thou shalt preserve me from trouble. Yes. Mm -hmm. Thou shalt come past me about with songs of deliverance. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, yes. yes. Thank you, Jesus. Sometimes it's good to have a little song. Yes. Have it in your heart. I mean, a true song. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. We all who are born again, we need something. From the most high. Yes. 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 Something from God. Yes. Yes. I need it. Yes. Yes. I'm telling you people, I need it. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Glory be to the Lord. Thou art my hiding place. He already told us. That if we trust him, he's going to hide us. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. He can hide us from all of these yeah. evil things. Yeah. As I think the sister was singing, bad spirits. Yeah. And you can feel them. Yeah. You can feel them now, but you can get so deep and God praises. Yes. They have to get off you. Yes. I'm telling you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. You're my hiding place. You will and you shall preserve me from troubles. Thou shall what? Come, Come pass me about mm -hmm. with songs of deliverance. Tell you you'll give me a praise yes. Yes. and a song so many times in the word of God is singing yes. something that not just a song you sing but something that continues yes. hallelujah yes. do you praise the Lord yes. thank you Jesus glory be to God Now, thank you, Jesus. I'm telling you, when the Lord, see, in his presence, God has, he, he has secured a place for us, and, and just anybody can't have it. Amen. Amen. Just anybody cannot have it, people. Amen. Let us go back to 91 and we're going to read verse, verse 2, I believe it is. Yes, ma'am. I will say of the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress. My God, in Him will I trust. Lord. You trusting in the Lord or you're trusting in yourself and in your own thoughts. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. So the sermon's here. What he was doing, he was giving um, directions. And encouragement. Yes. He was given. See, it's good to live a life so you can encourage someone else. Amen. Not try to 
beat them down. Amen. The people of God needs encouragement. And I'm so thankful that God, in his word, he gives to us encouragement. Amen now. He cannot give you encouragement if you're a liar. Amen. Bite batter. You somehow have your own encouragement. And you can go so long, you can believe it's right, and you can believe you are right, and you can believe sometimes things are from God. But no, they are from yourself. If you are not following God according to his word. But it is good to be able to give encouragement, to give right direction. But sometimes it seems as though people want to hear something that will satisfy their flesh, even if it's not the right direction. They would rather that. Know why? Because see, when you're in the flesh, that's what you, and when I said in the flesh, we're all in the flesh, but when you are pleasing the flesh, this is what you want to hear. Amen. Do you praise the Lord? Are you happy about Jesus and what he has done? <laughs> I will say of the Lord. Amen. He is my refuge. I'm telling you, it's good to have a safe place. When all hell is breaking loose. And you, as I said earlier, and you see no way out. It's good to be able to go to the word of God when you down in the valley and, and you read the word of God, then you trust him, he put you on the mountain top. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. And you know what else? Your situation yes. might still remain the same. Right. But yet, right. he has put you on yes, the mountain top. Yes. I thank the Lord. God is good. He's so good to wretched man. Thank you, Jesus. Good to know you're wretched. Even after being born again, you need to put the flesh down. Because it won its way. You have to put it down. Now, there's no way that we can say amen and God honor that if we are not living a clean life. One thing about God, he's holy. And he will receive nothing from us but his holiness. He's clean. Amen. 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 Thank you, Jesus. I know he is clean. He's so clean when he looked down on wretched man. He said he's wretched now. But I'm going 
trying to give him a way out. What is he going to do for him? I'm going to give my son. And my son, he will become willing to give his life. And that is exactly what he did. Do you praise the Lord? Thank you, Jesus. I will say of the Lord, he is my ret- refuge. Psalm 142. Thank you, Jesus. I tell you, you look around and you are able to see the glory of God. I'm telling you, people, you are able to see the glory of God. Thank you, Jesus. One of his glories is his mercy. Thank you, God, for your mercy. He suffered long. Charles Hasso. He suffered long. I can say it. I talked to him for years. Hours at the time. For a long time. But God. One day, one day. Was able to come. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, hallelujah. And show to him if he did not give his life to the Lord. What he would have to suffer through throughout eternity. And he said, even now sometime he can feel the heat. What a blessing. What a blessing. Now I'm looking at the glory of God. Yeah. What God has done for me. Yeah. I thank God. Oh, I praise God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Jesus. 142, verse 5. I cried unto thee, O Lord. Mm -hmm. I said, thou art my refuge and my portion. Yes. In the land of the living. In the land of the living. Thank you, Jesus. I cried. Yes. Yes, Oh, yes. Unto the Lord. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Jesus. It says that. This was when David was in a, in the cave, and I think somehow he was surrounded. But I'm not going to look at David so much. Amen. 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 I can look at myself, and you can look at yours. That's right. Amen. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Verse 1. Verse 1. I cried unto the Lord with my voice. Mm-hmm. With my voice unto the Lord did I make did I make 
my supplication. Thank you, Jesus. I made my request and all that was going on with me. I made it known. Yes. Uh huh. Verse two. I poured out my complaint before him. See, that's what we need to do. Yes. That's right. If we are that's able right. to see that we need some help. Yes, Lord. Yes. And if you be real. Yes, that's it. Show got to be real. That's it. That's it. Show enough, Lord. Pour out your heart to God. Yes. Satan will make it look like. It's hard. But when a person truly give their life to Jesus, they are not in and out and up and down. Amen. Brother Derek, make it plain. He said, I know where I came from. So what you're looking at now is the glory of God. It is what God has done for me, says Derek. Looking at the glory of God. I praise it. Praise God, saints. I cried unto the Lord with my voice. With my voice unto the Lord did I make my supplication. Mm -hmm. I poured out my complaint before him. Yes, Lord. I have some trouble in my life. Yes. That's right. Amen. That's right. Thank you, Jesus. That's right. I poured out my complaints before him. I what? I showed before him my trouble. I showed before him yes. my trouble. Yes. I'm telling you, sometimes no one knows exactly what you are going through. Yes. But certainly you can tell God about it. Yes. You can go to him and tell him about it. Yes. Thank you. Amen. Amen. I have some trouble yes. in my life. Yes. And I need you to help me. Yes. Amen. Yes. Sometimes I'm sure you can see that um, you, sometimes you seem to not be able even to reach God like you want to and feel his security feel and have the assurance that he hears you say so God I need you now Amen. I need you now if you done wondered all day and, and like I said and talked about people and done things that you that you have not repented of now you look to be that way. That's right. Amen. One way to be free is that we repent. I mean truly repent of sins in our lives. God. Thank you, Jesus. He can lead you through those muddy waters. Yes. Oh, yes, he can. Yes, he can. Do not. I, I would say try to. I smart God. Amen. See, God already, he, he knows exactly why we the way we are. Yes. I heard um, Brother Adrian say tonight, he said, 
I think he was talking, he was singing, but I think he was talking at this time, and he said um, something like this. He said, I found out that I myself was the reason I was the way I was. He said, I found out that. Isn't that something? We try to put, thank you, Jesus, but God said, it's a lie, and I'm going to have to stop somebody. I'm going to have to stop somebody that's trying to put, thank you, Jesus, the way they are is because of what somebody they thought did to me. Brother Adrian said tonight, he found out. And when he admitted, when he admitted that he was the problem, not what nobody did to him, not nothing he even thought. He says heavy load begin to fall off. Isn't that something? Isn't that something? Thank you, Jesus. It's good that God knows all about us. Amen? Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Verse 3, I believe. When my spirit was overwhelmed within me, mm-hmm. then thou loosed my path. When my spirit was overwhelmed in me, he knew. His path. Yes. God knew. Mm-hmm. In the way wherein I walk, in the way wherein I walk, have thy privately laid a snare for me. That talking about the enemy. Yes. Yes. That's right. Amen. And the enemy can be whosoever. That's right. Amen. Trying to lay snares. Yes. For me. Amen. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Verse 4. I looked on my right hand. I looked on my right hand. And beheld. And I saw. Mm -hmm. Uh Uh-huh. But there was no man that would know me. But there was no one there that knew me. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Glory to God. Read on. Refuge failed me. Listen. I had no hiding place. Yes. Refuge failed me uh-huh. because I'm looking now. I'm looking about me. Yes. And I do not see no one. Yes. Therefore, refuge failed me. Uh-huh. Do you praise it? Yes, Lord. Listen why it failed. No man cared for my soul. No man cared for my soul. Mm -hmm. That's right. That's why we have to look to Jesus. Yes, Lord. That's right. That's right. Amen. Amen. No man cared for my soul. Yes, Lord. Uh Uh-huh. I cried unto thee, O Lord. I cried unto thee, O Lord. I said, Thou art my refuge. And my portion in the land of the living. I found out that you were my refuge. Do you praise me? Yes, Lord. Are you glad about Jesus? Thank you, Father. In the name of Jesus. Glory be to God. What does he say? Verse 6. Attend unto my cry, for I am brought very low. Attend unto my cry, for I am brought very low. Sometimes when you are low, that is the time. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. That you can reach the Lord if you be right in your heart when you are real low. See, 
people with bad spirit, they say things. They, they, they say things, ugly things. They don't even know they've hurt people. And they're like, they don't even care. But they say ugly things. Thank you, Jesus. A ten give heed unto my cry. Mm -hmm. For I am brought very low. I am brought very low. Mm -hmm. Deliver me from my persecutors. Deliver me from my persecutors. He would persecute her. These people that are trying to bring me down. Yes. Yes. Deliver me from these people. Yes. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Yes. It is such a wonderful thing to have the Lord on your side. Yes. Oh, yes, it is. Yes. Read. For they are stronger than I. For they are stronger than I. You know, when people have demons. Now, people, they might say, well, those demons, uh, they, they, they don't bother me. But listen. These people that have demon spirits, and most folks do. The sum is here, which was David. He knew that they were stronger than he was. I know they are stronger than me. Therefore, I must allow God to take care of the matter. Yes. Amen. Yes. Oh, yes. Thank you, Jesus. Allow him. To take care of the matter. And if you are not walking in God, you might even say something. But God knows whether or not he can take care of the matter for you. Because he knows how we are living. He knows exactly what we've done, what, what, what we live, and who in whom we trust. We trust ourselves so many times. We trust ourselves. Thank you, Jesus. What did he say? Verse 7. Bring my soul out of prison. Now, I tell you, my soul, my soul is in prison. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, people, your soul in prison, your soul. The soul is, is the part that's going to live forever. Bring my soul out of prison. Thank you, Jesus. You can get in a fix. Those demons can, don't let them get to you, Joanne. Amen, Sandra. Thank you, Jesus. A lot of things can throw you. You might be sitting in service. It can throw you. Praise God. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Bring my soul out of prison. I need my soul to be free. Yes. If my soul is not free, I cannot praise the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Bring my soul out of prison. That I might praise the name, thy name. Thank you, Jesus. I've been surrounded by demons. Thank you, Jesus. 
Read on. The righteous shall compass me about. The righteous shall compass me about. Thank you, Jesus. It's Thank good to be surrounded yes. by the righteous. That's right. Yes, it is. I tell you, sometimes you can be surrounded with spirits to the point that you know that you cannot praise God. Spirits, evil spirits, is stronger than you are. They are stronger than I am. Therefore, I must trust God. Thank you, Jesus. Bring my soul out of prison. Because I need to praise God. There is strength in praising God. There is deliverance in praising God. There are happiness in praising God. There are freedom in praising God. Bring my soul out of prison. So I can praise you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. For thy, what? For thou shalt deal bountifully with me. And I tell you, Thank you, Jesus. God, he has dealt bountifully with us. Oh, yes. And I thank him. I thank him. Oh, glory be to God. My time is gone. A little bit over time. But I'm so thankful for the word of God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. He that dwells in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadows, shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, he is my refuge and my fortress. My God in him will I trust. Thank you, Jesus. Do you praise him? Yes, yes. Thank you, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Do you praise God? Yes. The Lord has a place, a wonderful place for the saints of God, the ones that fear him. The ones that walk in righteousness. And I want to tell him, thank you. Thank you, Lord, for what you've done for us. Thank you, Lord. For giving us a place yes. that we can praise your holy name. Yes. If you think you can praise God anywhere, you just go somewhere. That's right. And if you're born again, you'll know for sure yes. my praise has got to stay shut up yes. in me. Yes. But I thank God yes. I can tell him. Deliver my soul. Move me. So I can praise you. Thank you, Jesus. I thank the Lord. I thank him for what he has done. 
For God so loved the world. He gave heaven best. That whosoever. Believeth in me. Will not perish. But will have life. Everlasting. It is time to come to Jesus. Do we see our government? I never thought I would live to see what I see in this political world. But I'm thankful to the good Lord. No matter how much chaos, all the sin, brothers against brothers, husband against wife, wives against husbands, God has prepared a place for those that fear him. Let us rejoice and be happy. Those of you who please in the Lord. I thank God for what he has done for me. Truly, God to me, he has been overly good to us. I thank God. I thank him. I thank him. I thank him. When you look at time, and if you are not sure, come to Jesus. Why it is yet time before mercy door close. Come. May God bless you. And may God keep you. That's my prayer. Brother Derek.